It is a sad moment for women's rights in Bulgaria. Since January, a woman has been murdered every two weeks. In most cases, by a male current or former partner or relative. However, in a historic decision in July, the Constitutional Court in Bulgaria ruled that the most important European treaty protecting women against violence was inconsistent with Bulgaria's constitution. Eight of the 12 judges voted against the Council of Europe Convention on Preventing and Combating Violence Against Women and Domestic Violence, or the Istanbul Convention as it's commonly called. Bulgaria is one of the few EU member states who have not yet ratified the convention and the first to find it unconstitutional. The decision is considered to be political and lacking solid legal argumentation. And while the judges agree with the aim of the convention to fight violence against women, their decision focuses only on the language of gender roles and finds the term gender to be misleading and incompatible with the term biological sex in the constitution. The court even rejects the notion of gender as socially constructed characteristics of women and men, a notion which is necessary for understanding and tackling violence against women. In the court ruling, the judges claim that traditionally societies are built upon the idea of sex as a binary concept, that is, the existence of two opposite sexes, each of which has specific biological and social functions and responsibilities. The judges also claim that the convention paves the way for the infiltration of the terms gender and gender identity in the Bulgarian constitution. The ruling propagates existing gender stereotypes and denies protection and recognition of transgender and intersex people. More than 300 academics and 30 prominent NGOs working in the field of human rights publicly supported the Istanbul Convention. It is a sexist and transphobic decision that impacts thousands. We must ask Bulgaria now, how will it tackle the monstrous violence against women?